if I had to describe this boat in three words, um, a frickin' weapon. I'm Jason and this is my boat El Pescador. El Pescador is the fisherman in Mexican. Mexican fisherman is an old story with a philosophy on life. It's something that resonates with me. So yeah, it's a, it's a good story, look it up. It's a 925, we run the Garmin gear. Got all the bells and whistles so we can stay out overnight. So we've got the um, you know, toilet, shower, oven, hot water, cold water, fresh water, all that sort of stuff. Powered by a, a Volvo D6, so plenty of grunt. My favourite feature would, it's going to sound a bit lame, is, the, is probably the way that the boat handles. You know, the feeling safe out there is important to me, especially when I've got my family, so I've been in some pretty rough stuff and, you know, at no point have I felt unsafe. So for me, that's a, a massive feature, you know, beyond all the, the gadgets and the big screens and the, the other bits and pieces that go with it, but that'd have to be mine. With the Kingfish International, which is based out of the Bay of Islands, they ran the comp in some pretty nasty weather. They had a couple of guys who hadn't been in it before, um, and they referred to it as the limo of the sea. So, you know, we were sort of cruising back one night in some, some real nasty stuff, and, you know, they were just kicking back, and, yeah, so it was called the limo. <laughs> so it's a beast on the way out, and then there was a limo on the way home. We used to have a six metre from a, another popular brand. You know, sort of our family was growing at that point and, and wanted to go bigger in boat. So we entertained the next step up with that brand. But then there's actually a mate of mine who said, oh, you should go and have a chat to Alan. And I uh, went along, had a chat to Alan, had a look at what he was doing. I was blown away by Alan's passion. You know, he's, he's all for the pretty stuff on top, but you know, he's, he's very passionate about the, the structure and how the boat performs and you know, the, the, the science and the passion that was there just made it a no-brainer. That's a loaded question. Um, it's got everything I want in a boat and need in a boat at this point in time. But if I call it my dream boat, then that doesn't sort of leave anything for the future, does it? So, hey, I absolutely love this boat. It's, it's everything I want. If you did upgrade, it would be my car. 100%. Easy. <laughs>